welcome back to Lenfin Cocktails. Today we're going to make the Old Pal. It's kind of a riff on a Negroni featuring Campari, Dry Vermouth, and Rye. Today we'll be using Old Overholt for Rye, we have a Dolan for Dry Vermouth, and we have a Cacao Infused Campari, so we have a little bit of a chocolatey taste. I chose the Old Overholt Rye because I thought when I tried it, it had a little bit of a chocolatey you know, aftertaste to it, and I thought it would pair very well with the, the chocolate infused Campari. So I'm hoping that makes for a great cocktail. Let's go ahead and get this going. So because it's like a Negroni spec, it's equal parts, one ounce, one ounce, and one ounce. We'll start out with our cacao infused Campari. This is pretty easy to do yourself at home if you just grab a, a bag of the nibs, if you wanna just make this yourself. And we're gonna add one ounce to our mixing glass. Then we'll go one ounce of our dry vermouth. and one ounce of our Old Overholt Rye. So I wanna make this extra chocolatey, uh, kind of a on the fly decision here. So I'm gonna use these Aztec chocolate bitters from Fee Brothers and I'm just gonna use one dash because I know they're really strong. Now we're gonna crack our ice into our glass. Or you know, all over the countertop, whichever way it works. Give it a nice stir. Make sure our mixing glass gets nice and chilled down. It's a nice orange color. I think it would be a little darker color if we had a sweet vermouth, but we're gonna stick to the spec on this one. It looks like we're pretty chilled down. Let's grab our glass and strain. We have our chilled glass now right out of the freezer. And we're going to go ahead and strain that in. Looking good so far. Now let's get our orange. And we're going to take a nice peel. A good long peel of the orange. We'll zest our orange over it and fold up our nice garnish. And there we have the old pal. Now that we've made our cocktail and give it a nice garnish, let's go ahead and give it a try. Mmm. That is a delicious cocktail. Everything chocolate really comes through. You can really taste the bitters. They come through strongly on the back end. The Campari and the bitterness really shine. And the rye is back there with just enough spice to give it a good overall taste. But I think this would make a really great dessert drink. Uh, the chocolate really helps bring that along. If you had a nice piece of chocolate cake with this, this would be fantastic. Mmm, that, that is really good, yeah. If you enjoyed this video, please like and subscribe. Follow us on Instagram. If you have any cocktails that you'd like to see made, please leave us a comment and check out these other videos.